Welcome to Designer Digital's Tip of the Week, February 5, 2011. This week, how to cut photos and shapes in Photoshop and Elements. Here's a technique that's frequently requested. How to use the Custom Shape tool to cut out photos. Begin by opening a photo and a new document in Photoshop or Elements. Set the foreground color so that it contrasts with your document. My document is white, so I'll choose black as a foreground color and click OK. Select the new document and get the Custom Shape tool. This tool shares a space on the toolbar with the Rectangle tool and the Line tool and several others. Click and hold the tool to reveal the flyout menu of hidden tools and then choose the Custom Shape tool which looks like a blob at the bottom. In the Options bar across the top of the screen, Choose a shape from the drop down menu, and if you're working in the full version of Photoshop, you'll also need to click on this icon, which is the shape layer icon, and then you'll need to click here in the create a new shape layer icon. Shift click and drag out the shape on your document. Get the move tool and drag the shape into position. Now drag your photo onto the document. The photo layer should be positioned above the shape layer in the layers panel. If it isn't, just drag the layer one position above the shape layer. Then hold the Alt key or on a Mac system the Option key and place your cursor between the photo layer and the shape layer. When the cursor changes to a double circle arrow, click. This creates a clipping mask which causes the photo to take on the shape. Still using the Move tool, select the photo layer and then click and drag your photo into position to reveal the part of the photo you want to see on your project. To resize the photo, press Ctrl T or on a Mac system Command T and use the corner handles here to make your photo larger or smaller. Hold the Shift key if your version of the software is changing the aspect ratio and you're getting this funhouse effect. Then click the check mark to confirm the size change. Thanks for watching and be sure to check back next week for another Photoshopper Elements Tip of the Week.